I just, I just want to say thank you to you so much for, for saving my life. A local man alive tonight thanks to the heroic actions of a woman he never met. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Leslie Draffin. Chris Radcliffe will join us in just a moment. It is our top story tonight. A local man recovering after being pulled from a burning vehicle by a complete stranger. Six News reporter Andrew Moore shares the incredible story with us tonight. I hear this boom and I, I looked around. I was like wondering what, what it could have been. And I, I go ahead and I turn and go over the track. There's his car and his car is on fire. Elizabeth Page was driving home Sunday morning on 25th Street when she saw this black Camaro on fire. She called 911 and approached the car, finding Trevon Kendall yelling for help inside. I still, I don't know what I would have had to do. Like, I don't know what I would do if I had to just sit there and had watched him like burn. I really just grabbed and I just, I pulled, you know, like I saw, I saw maybe a chance and I just, I acted on it. Kendall is much bigger than Paige, but she was still able to drag him out of the car and then down this hill to the curb for safety. Kendall wasn't coherent enough to speak to her at that time, but we were able to speak to him in the hospital today and he had a very clear message he wanted to share. Elizabeth, thank you so much. Thank you. I, I, I tried to contact you earlier or yesterday. I, I just I just want to say thank you to you so much for, for saving my life. Kendall's mother, Tramika, told us he broke several bones in that crash, but he suffered no Burns. She says Paige driving by just seconds after the crash was much more than a coincidence. That's where that's where she was supposed to be at that moment for him. That's how I look at it. Paige says she simply could not have lived with herself if she had passed him by. And she can only hope others would do the same for her. If it was me in that position or if it was somebody I knew, like and nobody like in that one person was that one person around, like to save my life, like I hope they would stop. Andrew Moore, six news. Wow. The Kendall family says they look forward to finally meeting Paige in person this weekend.